All right. I am so beside myself. Uh, okay, so let me explain to you what happened in the nutritionist be uh, office because it's really helpful. I tell you this stuff, you know, one, it's like a therapy for me, but two, I hope to help somebody because this, all right, so for one year now, I have learned how to control my emotional eating with little practices, right? And then you master those, like I always say. And so I went in there today and I told her, and I think she knew that I, don't know, I was already, from the last time we got together, that I was not going to use my Lose It app so much. Um, I only used it once and I did, I recorded everything. And then um, I knew that I was gonna go over my calories because I wanted this certain keto ice cream yesterday actually, or well, the day before that. And, you know, I told her, I said, I didn't want to track because there's been a fire lit underneath me that is just so, when I say so, like so, uh, on fire for exploring this new world of like, I've always loved fruits and vegetables, but not like this. Like this is like a whole new world. I told her, I said, I don't know what it was. You know, maybe like a culmination of like what I've observed. You know, there's this one girl, Christine, I don't know what her name is. She's a raw diet person. Maybe you can look that up on YouTube. Just say raw diet christine maybe she'll come up she's got really really long hair she's super slender and she glows she lives in hawaii i think it is and she's just like she she eats pounds can i tell you of fruits and vegetables and it's wonderful to see and she looks she actually glows you know and so i just really have been exploring this new world and i didn't want anything to stop me i didn't want to be like oh, I can only have this much of it. Because if I did that, then to me, I wasn't really exploring. I was still putting um, restrictions and I didn't want to do that into this new world. It was like diving into a pool. Like, okay, so here's this beautiful, gorgeous pool, but you can only dive into it and then you can only go in the shallow end. I, I didn't want that. I, I just needed to really dive in deep. And so, so that honeymoon part and that understanding might be over. It's not like over and then I'm going to stop eating all of that goodness. But what I got to do now is I, I, I'm still not going to use the Lose It app right now. She wants me to record everything I'm going to eat. She goes, can you, take, can you take a picture of everything you eat? That'll, that'll be your homework. Just do everything like for a whole day. The life of, you know, the, you know how Lisa eats in a day. Okay, so I can do that. And the thing is, what I think I have to work on, because the whole time she was talking, what I personally have to work on, if I'm not going to follow the Lose It app, and I say this to you because perhaps you can do it too, is um, instead of doing the Lose It app, and instead of just running amok with whatever I want, I have to just, I was mindful about the amount of cheese I was eating, and I had a lot of enough bread to say Lisa that's uh you know we had a pizza here we had the bread over there at my friend's house because she made me breakfast um just to be mindful of the amount so like for instance his, his if, for instance I was I made a beautiful lunch beautiful salad I was completely satisfied and my daughter was making a cheese sandwich and she goes, Mama, I think this smells bad. And they think my sense of smell is out the door. So I said, you know what? Don't throw that out. Now, I could have tasted it, thought nothing wrong with it, and then put it into the refrigerator. But I didn't do that. I ate the three slices of cheese. So that was not necessary. You see what I mean? So it's little things like that. Or when I was eating hummus, I should, I had hummus and carrots while I was making my um, my sweet potato, I, I need to maybe dish out what I want when it comes to anything. If it's not a fruit or a vegetable, 
if it's going to be oils of any kind, if it's going to be cheeses, if it's going to be bread, if it's going to be um, even chickpeas, you know, like dish it out. If it's going to be lentils, like dish it out and, you know, monitor that more. Be more mindful of those things because I could I could say, oh, Sarah took out the cheese, right? And I can get some slices out of there. And, and you know, there is no limit. I'm not paying attention. I know I'm eating it. I'm recognizing it. I'm conscious of it. I'm not doing it blindly, but I'm not monitoring it. So there it is. Monitorization is what I need to do. Okay, but otherwise, so it went up one ounce in my weight, but I am so proud of myself. It's like, wow. I ate all that goodness. Well, it was two ounces it went up. It went up two ounces. And I'm like, out of all of that that I did, how is that even humanly possible? Like, I seriously was eating some serious fruits and vegetables. Now, if I, and I, and I, and I exercise all the time. So imagine if I didn't exercise, it probably would be way more. But um, my point of all of this is going to be to monitor the, the fats. There it is, the fats and the breads, because I don't eat bread on a regular basis like that. But like, you know, my birthday was celebrating and, and all that. And I had a great time and I don't regret any of it. Oh no, that's the other thing is, honey, be a big boy or big girl and say to yourself, you know what? I wanted to do that. I had a good time doing that. Oh yes, I still have been staying away from pastries and Oh my gosh, that's the other thing. Oh, I forgot to tell her. Oh my gosh, when my friend Kathy gave me the sugar-free cookies, me and Peter, I ate most of them. She gave me a box of sugar-free cookies and I was taking her out that night, do you remember? And yes, we I, the whole thing was gone by the time the night was over. Oh yeah, a little tiny piece was in the morning and I was like, yay. So so things like that, all right? The, the just setting free, those aren't fruits and vegetables, Lisa. And just because it is sugar-free doesn't mean you have to eat the whole entire thing in one night. So I wanted to do it. I'm taking responsibility for it. It was so much fun and I just love to chew. I think it's fantastic. I love it. So just to be more mindful about the fats. Very good, Lisa. Woo!